Hello everyone and welcome back to Agrarian Skies. So last time we left off we started working on automation. Unfortunately, I haven't had much time to do off-camera stuff. So we're just going to continue on as normal. So we dealt with these five, the simple ones. Now we're, yes, the simple ones. And all the other base ores are uh, already set up. So the next thing I'm going to want to work on is the nether ores. Now, I have the nether ores going into these pulverizers, which is simple enough. However, uh, they're both going to have outputs of nether rack, which is a problem. So fortunately, they already have all their orange output as orange output. So if I hook up the output of the pulverizers to our existing system, all the netherrack should be pumped into its proper barrel. So that should be, fortunately, the simplest process we have to do. But it is something we do have to do. So let's grab our impulse item ducts. Hello, guys. And let's hook them up to our existing system of pipes. Let's see here. Hmm. Okay, well, I'm going to have to rip this one out. That's okay. We can put a cover on it. And then... I guess I can just attach these two together. You attach together, right? And then that leads up and over. Yeah, perfect. Okay. So just like that should be fine. I'm going to eliminate the odds of something going wrong by doing that. And then connect those two together. And all of those are connected together, so that should pump the nether rack to its proper place. Proper place. And so on and so forth. Now, do I still have covers available? Uh, so, they're not in this box. Are they in this box? Mm, yes, there they are. Hello. For once, I saw something that was in my chest. I'm starting to understand how other people have this problem when they do recording stuff. Boom. And we can do the same here. Okay. Uh, now, I do have to make the barrels for those respective dusts, but that's fine for now. Uh, next thing we're going to work on is, since this isn't hooked up, we don't have to worry about that too much right away. So that takes care of the nether ores for the basic metals. Now we have to take care of the nether ores for these guys. Which... Huh. I was expecting that to... Well, I guess no. Why would it pulverize into diamonds? Or into diamond ore. Of course it would pulverize into diamonds. And, of course, you pulverize into redstone. Well, I guess that's simple enough. You pulverize into coal, correct? No, into coal dust. Well, that'll still work up with our existing setup. You pulverize into lapis, please. Yes. Uh, emeralds. Into emeralds, please. Absolutely. Uh, silver, lead, all that is already set up. Iron, coal, platinum, cobalt, ardite. Okay, so if that's the case, then you, 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 and what am I missing? Redstone? Yes. And redstone. All 
all just need to be put into those filters up above. Okay, so that's simple enough. I thought for some reason I was going to have to deal with more uh, vanilla ores, but I guess this makes sense. I'm not smelting them, I'm just pulverizing them. Uh, so emerald, diamond, uh, lapis, redstone, and coal. And my outputs are also connected to the to the full system, right? Yes, 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 they are. Okay, perfect. Uh, this needs power. Uh, so, where am I going to bring power in from? I could bring it from underneath. Although that seems risky. I'll say my best option is probably through that wall. Let's try that. Uh, right about here. Yeah, there's the power line. Uh, I was off just a little bit. And actually, I can run it down through here. Like so. And that just looks weird. I know it's never going to be in my vision, but... I don't like it. Okay. Boom. Okay, so everything should have power. Uh, let's see, these are facades, so I can put my barrels in under here just fine. Okay, so that deals with uh, nether ores as well. Those are all taken care of. Uh, do I have anything I need to put away? Not yet. I'm not going to call the, uh, call it off just yet. Okay. So, now we have to deal with... Let's see. Uh, Thomcraft ores. These guys. Can I pulverize you? Can't pulverize amber, so that sucks. Cinnabar. Can't pulverize you either, so I need to make two more furnaces. Uh, let's see, what else do we have? We have mana infused ore, which I can pulverize and then smelt, so that's fine. Uh, what else do I have to worry about? Certus Quartz has to be dealt with. I believe I can just Oh, really, huh? I can't get anything but dust out of it? In that case, I might just scrap it all, the, all together. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Because I think we get... We are, we're already full on quartz dust. Yeah. Yeah. So this system already produces more than enough of that stuff. So this is not going to be necessary. So we're just going to put you into the trash can. Sorry about that. Alright, so that takes care of that. Let's see, I've got five slots over here on this wall. So let's see, we can take care of mana infused ore, since that is a pulverizer and a furnace. Can we get four other things that require a pulverizer and furnace? Uh, appetite, probably just a pulverizer will do. Yep. So actually, five furnaces would be ideal. And for the ones that need a pulverizer, I can just hide a pulverizer up above them. So shiny, so one, two, three. You don't need a furnace, do you? No. How many ores do I have left to deal with? Saltpeter? Pulverizer, okay. Quartz, that is the oaky. 
Uh, no, that's saltpeter. Quartz. Uh, pulverizer. Okay, so I can do three furnaces and two pulverizers. Whatever. Actually, I'm also going to need a pulverizer for the shiny metal. So I need to make three of each. Three of each. One is a two-step process, the other are one-step processes. So, I'm going to need six machine frames, so I'm going to need six tin gears. Uh, I can put the rest of this stuff away now. Uh, so that should be fine. Uh, put you back where you were so that I remember. Put you there. And I'll put all the ores away after the tin is being taken care of. So that's three, so I need to go up to 24 to do six. You're a little low on lava. I think I'm going to top you up here. I don't know why I have four nuggets of silver in here. Oh, well, it'll be good to go in just a second. Alright, now we go back to here so I can dump this stuff in. Let's see, I'm making three pulverizers, so I'm also going to need six flint. So let's grab that while we're here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, and we're going to need, let's see, 12 redstone. For those, let's see here. If I go at thermal, thermal, okay, we have ourselves a, where are they? There's the redstone furnace and pulverizer, perfect. Uh, I'm also going to need three redstone just for that. Okay. And I'm going to need three redstone for the pistons. Perfect. Okay, so this should be ready. And we can start pouring these out while we work on other stuff. We're going to want the gear cast, not the ingot cast. Okay, there we go. And I can get to work on other things. Uh, let's see here. I'm going to need more gold, unfortunately. So you can keep going. I'll be back in just a moment. And let's see here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Fantastic. Tons of stuff. Okay, now we'll be able to pop another gear. Cool. Alright, so now I have more than enough gold. Uh, let's see. So I need six of you. You can take that. Here we go. And, oop, six of you. Uh, three of you go into here. I'm going to start making the pistons now. I also need to make bricks. Forgot about that. Should have grabbed the clay while I was there. I'm going to need more iron. And I can grab the clay now. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Boom. And then the clay. One, two. Let's see. That should be right. I think I just destroyed an arcane light there. Okay. You can take these. I'll take this. Oh, that was the last one. Okay. Uh, what else am I going to need? I'm going to need the same amount for those. So, 24 more copper. There we go. You can get to work. 
That's not quite ready for more yet. Uh, let's see here. One, two, three. And then we do the thing. Boop. Okay, we have pistons. Lovely. And then I can put that away. Actually, I'm going to need six times four is 24. I think so. 12, yes, 24. I'm also going to need that same amount of glass. Uh, okay, perfect. 24. Okay. Here we go. Perfect. And we have those. We have these. We have these. And these will be coming soon. Okay, now I go back over that and I do this. Oh, that didn't finish. I had a feeling I did that by accident. Okay, these are done. There we go, perfect. And actually, I can make the furnaces right now, so let's do that. Oh, hold on. What do the furnaces need? Oh, they need tin they need copper gears too. So, hold on. I need 24 more copper. There we go. Oh, that's not what I wanted. And you go in. And hopefully we can get all of this stuff done sooner rather than later. Perfect. Now, what I just realized is that the byproduct of one of these things is also sulfur. Which is a problem because uh, we need a ton. Uh, we have sulfur in the byproduct of a different recipe, which is on the other side. So, yeah, we're going to have to run a pipe basically from one side to the other. Where there's already a lot of piping between the two. Hopefully we can hijack some of that piping, but... Ultimately, it might be a bit of a frustration. Come on. We just got a few more of these to go. And we'll finish this episode with crafting the machines, and then we'll do the next part in the next episode setting them up how that's gonna work and here's our last gear lovely and kaboom so there we go three more redstone furnaces three more pul pulverizers and that's gonna do it for this one sorry I'm a little pressed for time today so I wasn't able to do a lot of this off camera or so on and so forth but at least now you guys know kind of what I'm going for. In the next episode, we'll set it all up, hook it all up to the automation, and then we'll just have a few more kinks to sort out before we can start hooking up our uh, laser drill to the rest of the system. I will see you guys then. Bye for now. Oh, and thank you all for watching all that fun stuff. If you did enjoy, feel free to leave a like, leave a comment. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys next time. Bye for now. <laughs>